Hello everyone, welcome back to Nishte Soman and in this video we would be showing you how you can set this enchanted netherite sword from Minecraft as your custom desktop cursor. I hope you are excited for this video. Let's get started. So first of all you need to go to Google here and just search Minecraft sword cursor. So this will take you to a website. Make sure it is this right and correct one. I would be posting the link in the pinned comment down below. So once you go there you will see these bunch of different types of cursors and this is not only for Minecraft you can literally find any cursor you want as per your liking but for now we will go for these Minecraft cursors and I am going to search netherite sword because I really want that. So you can see in this cursor search box I am just going to search that and you will find more options in this but what I want is this one because this is pretty cool and it is animated. So now all you need to do is just download this and don't worry it's totally safe. So a download will start down and end real fast. After that you just need to go to the search box here and search cursors. Then on the right hand corner just click mouse pointer setting. Then click additional mouse settings here. And finally click additional mouse options. And if you did all this right then you will come to this small final box here and there are some tire tabs here so just click on the pointer section and now if you click on the browse here then you will see there are many default different types of cursors as well already there for you so if you want you can of course select anyone from here but what we want now is the one I just downloaded right so just go to your downloads and if you have downloaded it properly then it should be right here and just click on open and just finally click apply and boom there it is your enchanted netherite sword which I have selected for now you can select anyone so in case you want to remove it or just change your cursor then just go to the cursors again click this mouse pointer settings click the additional mouse settings and yeah I think you should just have it by now just go to the pointers again and just click use defaults and apply and now you will have your simple default cursor again but mostly I think I just really like the custom cursor so I'm just going to keep it to lifetime or so but yeah in case you have a change of thought then here it was. I hope you enjoyed this video make sure you subscribe if you haven't and leave a like if you enjoyed and set a new custom cursor on your desktop and we will see you next time till then goodbye.